It's an unlikely meeting of two worlds, but thanks to Banquet in a Field put on by the women of Common Ground, people who don't live on farms are getting an education on agriculture with a seat that's front and center. So this will turn the header on. That's called the header. It takes 12 rows, 22 inches apart. So I'm going to get it started here. And it's Just sent. like that, right down there. Look at that. We're delighted to have guests come out and ride along on a beautiful day and see what, what happens at harvest time. Dane Larson has been involved in farming his entire life. And those corn ears roll around oh, in there. Oh, get the kernels off, huh? Yep. And Rick Stern has been in the clothing business his entire life. Okay, Rick, come on in. Okay. On this day, the two worlds meet in a field at harvest time in a combine, which has become a makeshift classroom. Dane is a great teacher. Dane taking off his corn crop. This year we really got great emergence. And Rick getting a bird's eye view. I had never seen combining corn close up so you could from the cab so you could see the corn cobs go in there. Dane educates Stern on harvest and how the combine operates. And what this does is pulls it pulls in the plant oh. and it's and it's it strips the ear off oh, of it. Wow. Something someone from the city never gets a chance to see in person. This is the elevator that oh, takes sure. the corn up into the hopper. All this is part of a mission by Julie Peterson with Peterson Farm Seed. When you think about a combine and you think about a buddy seat, what natural place is there for, for teaching somebody about farming? Does this pick up 95% of the corn? 99.99, very little header loss. A lot of farmers will say, I don't have time to be an advocate for ag. I can't speak well. How can I be an advocate for, for ag? All a farmer has to do is put somebody beside them in a buddy seat of a combine, and that person will learn so much about agriculture. Stern says he's always wanted to ride along at harvest time and admits he tries to stay on top of all the latest ag information. Because when the farmers did well, we would do well. Because they were, a lot of the, the farmers were our best customers. It's going to take a while for this type of thing to soak in because it's so much if you've never been in a combine. If we can educate non-farmers on it, I think that's going to help everybody. The combine ride-alongs are an extension to Banquet in a Field, which is designed to educate non-ag people about farming. Peterson says she plans to offer the rides again next year.